Hey everybody, how's life treating you? I'm Russ Robo and welcome to the Russ Robo Channel News for December. I've got a few bullet points that I'm going to read off and uh, we'll talk about the regular stuff for the um, uh, month for the channel. First of all, we've got, uh, let's see, War Tech Fighters. Ah yes, War Tech Fighters is still proven to be a pretty fun time, pretty fun to play. Uh, a person in the comments section let me know that uh, I can actually find parts to each of the different um, mechs and all the different... Uh, what was it? All of the different research objects uh, by going through the maps so I can find them as those little golden glowing gears that I found earlier so that's actually pretty fun. Uh, I'll know where to find those from now on so that'll help me out a lot. Uh, let's see the second point on here is EDF 5. Um, I plan on getting Earth Defense Force 5 for the PlayStation 4 and playing with my friend Skylar so that's gonna be a lot of fun. We're gonna try to make that work out. It's I really like it if you're not so into bugs and giant bugs and giant alien attacks then it might be a, a little bit much for you but um, it should be a pretty fun time to uh, pretty fun time to be had and uh, fun to be played I don't know if I'll be able to live stream it though because uh, the internet's kind of spotty around here especially after the storm but um, I should be able to upload some good videos of that and that should be pretty fun uh, let's see the next point on here is cross out it just says cross out but I knew what it meant um, I kind of, I don't want to say resurrected cross out, I mean, it's its own game and a lot of people have played it, but uh, I brought it back to this channel because it's come out with a lot of new updates uh, since it was on the, since it was first released in the um, beta on the PlayStation 4, which is uh, where I played it before, um, which was, uh, it was a really, I didn't like the episode, it was not good so I didn't put it in the uh, playlist. It was just sort of like a test of the game and it was an early sort of beta. Uh, now it's um, basically a full release, free to play, lots of uh, pay to play, well, not pay to win sort of stuff. I mean, you do have an advantage if you uh, pay in money to get these premium vehicles. But um, the ones you can get through the game, through leveling up and uh, collecting and scrapping and building new stuff are actually really cool. Uh, I thought of a new thing that I could do where um, I go through the, um, what do you call it, the Steam Workshop, where uh, people build and put up their own vehicles that you can test drive. I wanted to test drive a bunch of those in just um, specific episodes and sort of make a playlist out of it in between the ones that are just regular uh, raids or battles against other players. I figured that would be a pretty fun thing to do, reviewing those and just sort of having fun with them because uh, I've seen the designs on there and they're pretty crazy. Um, the next is new channel trailer. Uh, I'm gonna make I'm gonna be making the new channel trailer for this year um, to come out. I'm guessing sometime in January. Uh, it's gonna include all of the well, not all, but it's gonna include some of the best videos I could find on the channel uh, from just this year, probably in the last six or seven. Uh, bleh, probably in the last six or seven months. Um, there's there's been a lot of uh, little improvements, uh, better audio, better video, getting better with my editing software, uh, but there's still a long way to go, and um, I still want to branch out from uh, gaming content as much as possible, since you know there's a lot of let's play channels out there, and mine's just one in a million. Uh, but I have a lot of fun, and if you do have a lot of fun, it, it means a lot, you know. Um, other than that, I think that's pretty much all about the stuff for December. I'm not sure if there's going to be anything. Uh, special for just Christmas, you know, around the holidays, all that good stuff. I mean, I'm in Florida, so it doesn't snow down here, so there's no, like, snow building challenge or snowman challenge or anything silly like that. Um, mostly just some good games to come out, and oh, uh, I didn't actually remember to write this on the list, but I've been thinking about the, um, uh, Robot Arena 2 StarCore AI, uh, mod pack. Um, it's a bit more complex than I thought. There's a lot of robots on there. Uh, and I can't really seem to get the good camera angles that I want for the battles. Um, I want to be able to find out how to do that. Um, it, I believe it is a follow mode uh, camera. And it's a mod for Robot Arena Forever. Uh, I've seen it used a lot in some of my uh, like you know friends videos. And um, it, it follows the action of the two robots or three or four that are actually fighting. Instead of you having to control the camera manually which would be a vast improvement over the actual camera that I use. I also thought about um, like sort of a series that I could start where 
I review, not really review, but go back and play some of the older games from uh, back in my day, like Spyro, uh, Crash Bandicoot, Crash Team Racing. Um, uh, I didn't get the chance to play the new uh, Spyro game that came out, but um, I, I do look forward to EDF 5, and uh, I think Crash Team Racing is going to come out with a remaster soon, too, so that ought to be pretty fun, and um, I hope, uh, hope all things are going good, and um, so I hope all things are going good, and I'm just going to keep trying to improve things uh, as best I can from here on out. Uh, that's been all for the Rust Robo Channel News for December. And thank you all so much for watching, and until next time, take it easy, my friends.